gas saturation for relative gas relative permeability hysteresis. All right, and again, we want to play. Right, you can look at the plum migration, right? Over time. And we can also click this one to look at the result at the end. Again, we can also prop display. And we want to show as well, for example, gas saturation for KRG hysteresis, as well as the residual, residual gas saturation for KRG hysteresis, and this one, SG less than critical gas saturation, hysteresis dynamic trap gas saturation. Click OK, and then go to the left again. and play the simulation again. So you can, the, you can read the message, the location of the block, the cell, the gas saturation for KRG hysteresis 0 0.55, residual gas saturation for KRG hysteresis 0 0.33, and also the gas saturation less than critical gas saturation hysteresis dynamic trap gas saturation 0 0.31. So we can activate this view by this prop display. Okay. It's great, right? By the way, no problem here. We have the cell colored blue. So it doesn't matter what we have in dashboard where we have different color, doesn't matter. That doesn't influence our interpretation or conclusion, right? So you see, because of hysteresis trapping, because of residual trapping, okay, residual trapping, we, we have more CO2 trap, not at the top, but across this interval, this vertical section. And then we fast forward. Okay, and at the end, this we will get. All right, so it's great, so far so good. Now let's check at the time series plot. 